one of the core tenets of this channel is adventuring with electric vehicles. Now, obviously there's the small scale stuff like backpacking on my electric skateboard and soon the electric snowboard and building, but I was also talking about doing overlanding and backcountry camping with the Tesla Cybertruck. Now, the thing is the Cybertruck is still probably two years away before delivery start here in Canada. And I really want to be able to do EV camping and adventure content. So for now, until I get the Cybertruck, I bought a Model 3. Now, I am still fully committed to getting the Cybertruck once I can, but in the meantime, between now and then, give or take about two years, I can use the Model 3 to prove out a lot of the things that I wanted to do with the Cybertruck. Now, obviously the Model 3 cannot do the same things that the Cybertruck can. It can't go on the backcountry on really rough roads, can't go off road really, but it can still do a lot of the lighter duty stuff that I wanted to do with the Cybertruck. Things like front country camping, road trips, and like I said, still plan on doing all of that with the Cybertruck, but between now and then I get to do all sorts of EV, outdoors, camping, and adventure content without having to wait until then. And I like to come from a place of ownership and experience. So I could go ahead and make all these videos anyways, but without actually owning an electric vehicle, it feels like I'm talking out of my ass. And I don't like that. I'm sure you guys don't like that either. So by actually owning an EV, when I make these videos, I have some skin in the game. And I can start to make videos like proving that you can charge your Tesla out in the middle of nowhere with renewable energy, like with water generators, wind generators, solar, and even thermoelectric. I'll be able to take it winter camping and prove that electric vehicles do fine in the middle of winter even when it's super cold. I'll be able to experiment with the self-driving capability to get me to and from camp. I'll get to experiment with different overnight sleeping options in the Tesla itself, which is surprisingly roomy and does actually have room for you to lay down and sleep in it despite it only being a small sedan. It's actually got more space in it for that than my Mazda 3 hatchback. So what Tesla did I get? I got a Model 3 standard range, rear wheel drive, white exterior, white interior with the standard 18 inch aero wheels. It's got about 420 kilometers of range on a single charge and it'll be really cool to prove that even with a super light duty electric vehicle like that that it's actually got a lot of things going for it when it comes to camping and outdoors adventuring. And the reason I can do this now is because my current car, the Mazda 3, is paid off as of this week and I'll be getting my title next week. Currently it says my Model 3 should be delivered sometime between November 20th and December 1st. Hopefully that delivery window sticks. Some people are getting it sooner than what their initial window says. Some people are taking almost twice as long. We all know Tesla and their timelines. But yeah, once I take delivery, this Model 3 will absolutely be a centerpiece of this channel. So let me know what kind of videos you guys wanna see me do with the Model 3. What kind of outdoors activities you wanna see me do with it. Do you wanna see me take the self-driving on any specific type of road? I know I'm really excited to see what I can do with it. So let me know what kind of videos you guys wanna see down in the comments. And uh, this is going to be an expensive car, so uh, <laughs> Can you please subscribe? I would greatly appreciate it if you haven't already. So yeah, that's about it. Just wanted to let you guys know that that's on its way and it's gonna be one of the cornerstones of this channel. And uh, don't worry, this video is not taking place in my regular video. That one's still coming out next week. And before I go, if you guys wanna see my other videos as they relate to EVs and the outdoors, make sure you check out the card on the screen now and I'll see you guys later.